Since the beginning of mankind, the jungle has been one of the most dangerous places where it's hard to survive. There, nature spreads to every corner, and in the least expected place, you can find a hideout of some unknown creature ready to tear the intruders apart. Definitely, no one is safe in this ecosystem, and if you join us in this occasion, you'll discover five reasons to stay as far away from the jungles as possible. Do you think that's an exaggeration? Then it's time to prove it. Join us in a journey to the heart of this wild and danger-filled world and prepare to be amazed. Number 5. The first of the strangest creatures that have been discovered in the jungle has its origin in Indonesia. Specifically in Java, a very particular place where nature has been expanding without limitations until it has become a real danger for its inhabitants. It's said that among the undergrowth of this place, creepy creatures are hiding. Numerous tourists have heard rumors of hundreds of footsteps lurking in the shadows, prowling between the trees and ambushing the clueless who take the wrong path and reach their lairs. Witnesses who have encountered these beasts have given them the nickname Sewell, which means small in the local language. They got this name because they don't exceed one meter in height, although they possess a wild instinct that makes them the most dangerous beings in the entire jungle. They're usually described as small humans with ape-like features that are completely naked and have abundant black fur. They usually travel in groups jumping through the jungle. On some occasions, it's been observed that they are armed with small tools made out of wood and sharp iron that they use to leave corpses in the path, although they're also useful for climbing and feeding. They have often been compared to goblins, but unlike goblins, the Sioux will have no malice, but rather a killer instinct that compels them to attack intruders and guard their borders like wild lions. However, these little jungle dwellers could almost be called friendly creatures when compared to the next monster on the list, although it would be more appropriate to call it the Beast of Madagascar. Number 4. It's said that animals lose all connection with the world in the jungle, as this hostile habitat forces them to fight against everything around them. Madagascar is a good example of this. Here the rules are determined by survival, and when it comes to predators, few can compare to Kidoki, the beast that no one has managed to classify, even though it has attacked tourists and locals on numerous occasions. There are no explanations that can provide any theory as to what exactly this animal is, but descriptions place it at something similar to a 25-kilogram lemur that has been prowling the jungle since 1995, attacking all living creatures it encounters. Generally, the natives know it as a versatile animal capable of climbing trees or running at high speeds to catch its prey. Few have managed to cross paths with it, although no one goes to great lengths to accomplish such a feat. Even so, this beast is famous throughout Madagascar, although when it comes to popularity, the next creature has managed to grab the attention of half the world and continues to cause panic among the locals. Number 3. To meet the next creature, we must return to Indonesia, specifically to Flores Island, a beautiful place that hides a bloody secret. The indigenous Naji people, better known as the Guardians of the Earth, live to the east of this island. For generations, their struggle has been fierce and that has led them to fight numerous adversities, although few can compare with the monsters that come from the jungle. The stories assure that they are tiny beings, no more than 1 meter 20 tall, called Ibu Gogo. They are believed to feed on anything from plants and fruits to the rotting flesh of corpses and cemeteries. For the natives, these creatures are a real headache. They are generally described as having simian features, hairy bodies, large and rabid mouths, and strong and swift limbs that they use to escape an attack with equal ease. Some witnesses claim that these creatures have managed to perfect their language and can now communicate like humans, but using a much more primitive language. No one knows what messages are exchanged between them, but one thing is certain. Their words hold nothing but rage and bloodlust. Something similar happens with the next creature on the list, although she doesn't need to talk to anyone 
in order to know what to do when someone makes the insane mistake of getting in its way. Number 2. The next creature inhabits the heart of the African jungle, specifically between Cameroon, Uganda, and the Democratic Republic of Congo. The natives flee from it as if it were an infernal demon, and many have even been forced to migrate from their homes to escape its nocturnal attacks. Its name is Jabba Fofi, which translates to giant spider, a title that shouldn't be used lightly. Here, reports of these creatures aren't only frequent but have become a veritable plague. No one is safe. Tourists fall into their nets and disappear. Villagers come across them in the middle of the roads and although the impossible has been done to hunt them down, more always appear. It's said that the Jabafafi are shaped like tarantulas, but unlike tarantulas, they can measure between 1.5 and 1.8 meters in length. This, of course, makes them the great predators of the jungle. Their killing methods are very varied. Every part of their bodies is a lethal weapon and nothing escapes the voracious appetite that keeps them constantly feeding to maintain their size. However, this arachnid king isn't the most terrifying thing you might encounter in the jungle. We haven't talked about one of the most dangerous places in the world where mysterious events occur and all kinds of creature inhabit ready to tear apart anyone who crosses its borders. Number 1. Few jungles in the world have as much life and risk as the Amazon. Located in the heart of South America, this place abounds with hair-rising stories, though none can match the numerous accounts of unusual events that have been recorded for the past two decades. Those who dare to venture into the Amazon live an experience that transforms them, although not always in the best way. This is something that numerous visitors have experienced. Most enter with the idea of camping quietly in the shade of the giant trees and sheltered by the noise of nature until things go wrong. And what could go wrong? Do animals attack? Does nature become hostile? Is the weather calamitous? None of the above. Reports indicate that groups of reptilians are hiding in the Amazon, robotic humanoids that attack the camps and kidnap people. No one can explain the origin or intentions of these creatures with precision, but sightings and attacks have been reported on the Peruvian, Bolivian, Brazilian, and Venezuelan sides of the Amazon. All accounts agree on the same point. The creatures had a completely black human body. The reptilian face was sometimes hidden in an iron mask, and they all made the same metallic sounds. When encountering them, a blinding dream suddenly comes, which paralyzes the victims and leaves them unconscious. Of course, like the rest of the creatures in the list, these unknown beings continue to be enormous mysteries, not only to those who investigate them but to natives and visitors of the area. No one can fully understand the nature of this place or what makes it the layer of so many anomalies. But one thing is for sure, if you ever decide to vacation in the jungle, you better be careful, very careful. You never know what you might find there. However, the jungle isn't the only dangerous place on our planet. The world is full of secrets and if you check out the next videos, you too can be surprised by the many creatures hiding right there that so-called boring place where you thought nothing was happening.